very much for helping me no with problem. this. Uh, temporally, and this effect on the painting medium of expression as an ontological tool. Um, <clears throat> why can painting as a medium of expression be considered an ontological tool as an alternative way of education? The expression of painting, the evolution of the human being, the temporal and spatial direct, uh, displacement as a result of the evolution of college. Um, the transdisciplinary character of painting through the uh, absorption of challenge and challenge of knowledge, hybridization of mediums, post-medium condition, the perception of time as a factor in painting and in social transformation, the copy and the original in painting, art, a temporal transformation of image society morphology, new ways of uh, involving time in art, new um, perceptions of uh, existence. And conclusions, thank you. <clears throat> Why can painting as a medium of expression be considered an ontological tool? We can say that the process of attending knowledge is synonymous with the emancipation of men depending on the ever deepening self-discovery and the consequent transformation of the world, followed by the readaptation of these transformations. Thank you. It is well-documented fact that the shift of uh, attention towards the future evolution and progress in history of humanity and the emergence of great technological transformation had direct consequences in the painting history. We believe that the perceived special displacement of painting art beyond of the natural process of orientation towards the new as a fundamental characteristic of it and the human condition uh, begins with avant-garde. This occurred through the glorification of innovation, deliberate uh, projection of the future and the placement of uh, things to that can be called mechanical movement. The expression of painting, uh, the evolution of the human being, a temporal and special, uh, spatial displacement as a result of evolution of knowledge. I want to please uh, you to stay uh, here a little more. Everything um, um, having been freed from the spatiality of architecture, painting through the uh, Van Eyck mirror in the Arnolfini portrait, Re, uh, extend spatiality beyond what uh, is directly visible. Edouard Monet balcony aims to occupy the border between the frames, interior and exterior, uh, practically constituting a passage. Later, we have the fusion of the interior with the exterior through the spatial non-differentiation between them in uh, Henry Matisse's obsession with the open windows. And uh, opening the space of the canvas by painting, uh, by placing the forms um, or uh, grids directly on the unidentified background between the canvas and the wall by Malevich and Mondrian, shift the attention of the ex extended gaze beyond the visible but felt uh, level to the sensitive world uh, of the abstraction. Finally, through the literal cutting of the canvas, a performative uh, temporal uh, gesture by Fontana, the distance between the spatial reality of the painting and the real uh, physical space will be uh, definitively eliminated. All this alternative form of uh, reporting to space actually mean a dynamic and flexible process in time and denote a fluctuating placement of attention in relation to the different levels of reality. Thank you. The other one, please. Oh. Uh, the next one, the next one. Oh. Let me on again. Uh, once more. <laughs> okay, thank you. And uh, now to understand what is uh, under uh, these images, um, we can close a look uh, closer at uh, one of the examples. Fontana is the initiator of the White Manifesto, uh, in which he reiterated the process of Italian futurism, promoted a synthesis between painting and sculpture, 
and emphasizing the importance of new technology in the context of art as a bridge between art and science. This idea is based on the belief that scientific and uh, philosophical development of uh, uh, have transformed the human psyche uh, to such an uh, extent uh, that traditional static art forms and the differentiation of artistic dis uh, disciplines have been uh, exceeded in favor of uh, new uh, synthetic art that will uh, involve the dynamic principle of movement in time and space. In the manifesto uh, of uh, the so-called spatialismo, he promoted an art that involved not only the visual, but also sound, movement, and time. Um, now the consequences of this uh, kind of reflections. Um, the transdisciplinarity character of uh, painting through the absorption of and challenge of knowledge means uh, hybridization of uh, mediums, um, what was called by Ursaline Kaos post-medium condition, which is the main uh, characteristic of uh, postmodernism. If uh, abstract art originally draw uh, its shape from physics, music, literature, etc., by creating systems of understanding similar to them and uh, therefore borrowing knowledge and the methods, then what uh, was constituted, for example, as sound art or performance, even meant borrowing the language or medium of expression itself. By looking at uh, uh, directions such uh, as bio art uh, or new media, we can even observe the borrowing of uh, specific instruments to the laboratory for new technology. The next one, Messi. In social terms, uh, this uh, adaptation in, uh, itinerary mirrored in the new means of expression uh, of art is explained by Barbara Stengler in her book, Adopt, about a new political imperative. She states uh, at, the, at the feeling that we uh, are behind the demands of the future was already felt two centuries ago. Stegler also observed that the adaptation of men in this process of uh, becoming also involves the way in which uh, time was felt. And this, uh, although is not only related to the neoliberalism, but is a previously noticeable phenomenon, has given why to a seemingly insol insoluble conflict between the human species and the environment which is no longer manages to know and understand. The change in, uh, in reporting on time addressed uh, in the art of the last decades, a period that was begun to be accepted uh, as uh, post postmodernist seems to come with uh, such uh, anticipations of new possible changes regarding the perception of time which could offer us alternative to the great acceleration, this uh, progressive growth in all planes of our uh, existence. The perception of time as a factor in painting and in the social transformation. We could observe that our characteristic ability to anticipate the future constitutes a fundamental attribute of its relation to temporality. Um, the uh, um, experimental degree and uh, innovation of some uh, works is given by this uh, advance that it has in relation with the present. The copy and the original in painting art, a temporal transformation of image, image society morphology. Uh, for Picasso, making a copy after a work from the past is no longer a mastery lesson, but an opportunity to highlight the formal gap with the past and the highlight of the originality of the painter. The replica of Fontaine made by uh, Sherry Levin only extends the notion of ready-made, um, initiated by Duchamp, to the level of the whole art in general without bringing its own innovative part. Um, the restaging of his, uh, of uh, Yves Klein, uh, Lipo into the Void by Ciprian Mureșan 
is a kind of mirroring of uh, postmodernist uh, pessimism, the broken wits of uh, Icarus. Okay, and uh, now if we look at some examples characteristic for uh, post postmodernist, such as Fred Wilson, through the intervention metalwork, the rearrangement of the exhibition already existing in a museum, um, redefine, rewrite the historical path, putting in the same context objects of uh, pleasure, like uh, sumptuous metal vessels, and the uh, symbol of uh, prosperity during uh, colonial colonialism, with those of uh, oppression, chains which, uh, with which uh, slaves were uh, depressed uh, of freedom and uh, oppressed. Pierre Hugues uh, show us other perspectives on the human uh, perception of reality in relation to that uh, of other living things or uh, the environment in general by recontextualizing um, the portrait of uh, Sleeping Muse by Constantin Brancus alongside uh, a leaf uh, crustacean place to co coexist in the aquarium in the artwork uh, Zudrum 4. And now, uh, the new ways of involving time in art um, is uh, somehow new, um, means somehow new perspectives on existence. Um, the starting point of the retrospective held by Pierre Hugues at the Pompidou Center in 2011, in which uh, he exhibited the artwork that Zudram for, was placed in the verses of um, Elliot, time present and time past are both perhaps present in the future and the uh, time future uh, contains in time past. The whole intervention called uh, Birdman by Yona Nemesh seems to recall Elliot's poems in which the movement of time uh, breaks out the linearity becoming circular so that the past, present and future are no longer receive linearly, but contain each other equally. Thank you. Here is uh, just an example for uh, from uh, my uh, artwork. It's in detail, which can be um, read in a loop. Everything depends on, everything depends on, and, <laughs> and so on. You will see further why uh, I show you this. OK, we can go further. Uh, Humboldt consider uh, existence as a complex dynamic system that can only be understood if we look at it as a whole, in which all uh, geographical phenomena, all organism, uh, chemical factors, and uh, human action interwine. Uh, implicitly, in extension to this, the natural uh, uh, way of human infinitude to involve uh, technological development uh, that uh, for uh, shadow. Probably uh, by a man's ability to regain his uh, faith uh, in uh, humanity and faith in his deep direct uh, connections uh, with nature, going through the process of uh, awareness, acceptance and uh, healing of the collective traumas of the past and um, awaiting the sense of guilty um, by uh, rewriting his experiences and once more uh, by his ability to regain confidence in his own uh, imagination to make uh, the all and uh, visually visualize new perspectives uh, to resign hope and meaning to them and to act uh, accordingly in the present will depend on the balancing of uh, merge of momentary um, existential uh, troubles. Therefore, perhaps by a review of uh, relationship with time, uh, not the programmed, uh, programmed uh, progressive uh, design of the future, which excuse uh, the means of actions and um, maintain the acceleration of uh, consumption, but uh, following the obvious fact in uh, the current age of uh, neurolinguistics, that the present is written, written simultaneously both in the past and in the future, resulting in a kind of uh, equivalence between them. 
Thank you very much for your attention and uh, sorry again for uh, giving you more time. <laughs>